Hi, it's Sheila from She's a Sassy Lady, and today we are going to learn how to slice on our Explore. Now, as you notice, I always use a grid because I find it it's much easier to work with. And today what I'm going to do is make a teddy bear EOS holder. So I'm going to go to my images because I always search there first. And then I want to feed in teddy bear because I want a little teddy bear. And I know which one I want because I've, I've used it before on cards and it's a little teddy bear with a great big hat like a southern bell teddy bear and this is for the um, here it is for the uh, oh and I want a circle for the card party it's going to be one of the little gifts that they can pick out we make we buy gifts and make gifts so that the ladies can have uh, during contests they can win an item and they choose what they want to move. Oh, I want a circle, not a card. And I'm going to just pick the first circle that looks just fine and take it. Okay. And we're going to insert the images. And I like to, you can make this as big as you want, but I'm going to keep it reasonable. I'm going to put my little bear there. And... Oh, that looks about right. Let's see how, oh, we got to get this the right size. For an EOS holder, it's got to be one and a half inches around the circle. So I'm just using my little corner thing here. 149, 152, 146. There we go, 151 is close enough. And as you can see, it's going to fit right on its little belly there. I'm going to make it just a little bit smaller. little bit smaller I don't want this great big huge thing and I want it to fit within well we'll see the scraps that I have and it's not going to fit in the scraps with that yeah that one will work then that way I've got it I can fit it right within like a six by six six by six and a half square so now you need to know that on the um, Whenever you use the slice, it will not go through more than one layer. So you're going to have to separate this out. Now, right down here at the bottom right, you can see I am ungrouping. It doesn't show the full thing, but you know where it's at. If you cannot get it to work or cannot see it on your computer, do a right click. Oh, you got to be on it. Do a right click. Come on here. Giving me a hard time. It's showing there, but I guess it doesn't want to. Okay. I'm pulling all the goodies off the uh, bear so we can put this on its belly and we better put it on front and just go up by a range to get it to the front and put it right there okay then what you have to do is you have to group them together so remember how to do that real quick you can't do an all uh, select all so you're gonna have to put a blue line around it and then you want to group it which is right here now, once you group it, as you can see, why is it not doing that? Slice hasn't come up yet. Hold on. I must have something else here. No. Let's ungroup and look to see if I have something else in the way here. No. Put it on. Move the hand over get it grouped together group click and slice isn't allowing me ungroup I'm sorry ungroup now slice is available slice it sorry about that you don't have it grouped together okay then I'm gonna put the other bear on and it's I'm gonna put it right behind so I can see where it goes get it lined up as much as possible the beige is a little bit larger than the brown is so that you know if you do this one you just gotta get it centered as close as possible there we go oh. when I let go I move it shame on me there we go 
put the brown back on, the brown circle that we cut out, line it back up, move the bear, and then grab them both together again, hit slice, and you've got a hole in the bear's belly. Put this together again, and it's going to cut out perfect. Now on this, I'm not going to cut out his belly because we made a hole in his belly. So I'm going to touch contour, get rid of that, and put his little face on, put it on a range on top, put the little face on. Ooh, I better put the hat on first. Put the hat on and arrange it to the top. There we go. Put the little face on. And we'll arrange it to the top in just a second. Arrange to the top. There we go. Put this little goodie on. Arrange to the top. I like to look at it when it's all done to make sure that I have everything just the way I want it. Now I have a, a little pink and white EOS, yeah, so I'm going to pick a different color hat than the purple, just so that you know. And I will cut this out. I'm not going to put a picture of it on this, um, this uh, particular, what do I want to say, uh, this particular Um, post, not post, YouTube video, you'll have to go to my blog, which is she's a sassy lady dot blogspot dot com. I'm going to group this together and we're all ready to hit the go button. Oops, no, we're not ready to hit the go button. I forgot to delete this and see where you can do a delete like that, or you can use just the key, the delete button. Okay, go. And it's all ready to cut out. Simple as can be. I can't wait to see you using the slice option on your Explore. I think you will love it. It's It just works out great. You have a blessed day. Thank you for joining us today at She's a Sassy Lady. Bye now.